Hi, I'm Dr. Ray Drury, and I want to talk to you about the five little known reasons why you should visit your chiropractor, specifically an upper cervical chiropractor. One of the things that I've noticed, almost every patient that comes into me, uh, one of the first things they start to see is they sleep better. And that is so, so, so important. A lot of things happen when you sleep that that's when your body rebuilds itself. That's when your immune system rebuilds itself. That's when muscles that you break down through the day fighting gravity, they have an opportunity to heal. So most of your healing takes part in deep sleep. So getting in, getting better sleep is huge. So that's number one. People, almost all of our patients notice that they sleep better. Number two, what happens when you sleep better? You have more energy. Huge, right? They have more energy to get through the day, to, to go to work, to get up in the morning before your alarm goes off. You're not dragging at the end of the day. Oh, I'm so tired. I don't know if I can make it. Your energy levels go up, right? So the next thing I usually tell people what happens is, and this is a great time of year to come in and get checked for this, is the third thing that we almost notice on everyone is your immune system. Your immune system gets stronger. How is that? Well, your nerve system the overall function of your nerve system is the result in your overall function of your immune system. See, your nerve system can, can, uh, creates the T cells and the lymphocytes and all the things, the phagocytes and all those things that keep your body healthy, help you fight off viruses and bacteria. See, it's not the viruses and bacteria that cause sickness or else we'd all be sick because they're all over you, right? but it's the lack of balance, okay, to keep them in check. Without bacteria, we wouldn't survive. So we need a check and balance to keep us healthy. So when your immune system gets weak, we lose balance. So then the bacteria and the viruses actually grow beyond normal, and that's when we start to have sick symptoms of being sick, right? So sleep better, better energy, immune function, stress relief is number four. How could that be? Well, I've heard so many times people say, well, I carry all my stress in my neck or I carry all my stress in my shoulders. Well, this is what happens, okay? When you put stress on anything, uh, it the first thing to go is the weakest area, okay? If you had put stress on a dam, you know, that dam's going to hold. But if it starts to give, it's the weakest part of the dam that gives. Well, this is what happens with the human body as well. The weakest part of the body that gives is where you're going to feel it. So what we do as chiropractors is we're going to find the weakest part of your body, and we're going to correct it, and we're going to make that part strong again. As that part gets stronger, then you no longer feel the same effect. The same stress will not affect you as it does when your body has weaknesses. If we keep your body strong, then you won't feel it so much. So the stress is still there, but it's not affecting you because that part of the body has now gotten stronger. Now, another thing that we often see in our office and people come to us without even realizing that there's actually a lot we can do are disc problems. We have a lot of people with disc problems. A lot of them come in here and don't even know they have a disc problem. They say, oh, I've got pain going into my shoulder. I got pain in my butt or down the leg or my toes are getting numb or my hands have numbness and tingling at night when I try to sleep. See, these are all the effects of disc problems. And you may have a disc problem without even having any neck pain or maybe without having any back pain, but it could be bulging to the point it's affecting something in your extremities, your hands, your arms, your elbows, your shoulders, uh, your legs, your feet, your knees, right? So people come into us all the time and what happens is if the spine gets a little bit out of alignment, the disc that's sitting there will start to bulge a little bit because they're like a little jelly donut, has a gel nucleus in the middle. And as long as they're stacked up on top of each other as they should, then they stay balanced and that little nucleus in there stays where it's supposed to. But if one of the bones gets a little bit twisted or bent or whatever, that little nucleus, that little gel part will actually start to lean out a little bit and come a little bit outside towards the nerves. And you have all of these nerves that come out both sides of your spine from your head down to your tailbone. And if a disc gets out, it can affect those nerves and you'll feel it in other parts of the body. So the five things that people don't often associate with chiropractors is sleep, energy, immune function, disc problems, and, uh, uh, wait a minute, immune, wait a minute, sleep, energy, 
immune function, uh, stress, and uh, disc problems, okay? So, if you have any of those problems, or if you would like to just live better, right? You're going to feel better. You, I mean, if, if you sleep better, if you have better energy, if you have a stronger immune system, if you have no disc problems, and you can cope better with stress, obviously life's going to be better. Find a chiropractor near you. More specifically, find an upper cervical doctor. That's what we specialize in, the upper two bones in the neck. So find an upper cervical doctor. If you live in the Charlotte area, Pineville, Rock Hill, Mint Hill, uh, Belmont, Gastonia, give our office a call. We're the doctor for you. We never charge for initial consultation to see exactly what's going on. If it's something we can help you with, we'll explain to you what we need to do. If it's not something we can help you with, we'll find someone that can. It's that simple. Either way, it costs you nothing. Give our office a call, 704-588-5560. I look forward to meeting you. Let's see what we can do to improve your life. Have a great afternoon.